As we can see globally, the various pandemics and endemics, new diseases emerging. And um, the thinking is every single entity has to be prepared for any outbreak. Um, I remember when I started this job, January 2020, I was chasing after Lassa fever. In February, it was COVID, and this year, it's monkeypox. So there's no doubt that we need the infrastructure and human capacity development to respond to this. What Ogun State is doing is we're actually in the process of constructing our own public health uh, laboratory, which would have equipment, the you know international standard equipment to respond to any outbreak, be it bacterial or virology or even waterborne. We've got that. We've also, we're also constructing our uh, emergency operations center, which is, will be purpose built, which then means that when we get signals from any local government or ward, we can follow it up. But that can only be possible when you have um, electronic medical records, which His Excellency has approved and will be really implementing that so that our PHCs will now have the electronic medical records which then would be would link with the emergency operations center to uh, alert us when there's an uncommon outbreak in any of our wards so those are part of our preparedness but equipment infrastructure without the um, the workforce is, is is not useful so we are also investing in our workforce building the capacity of our public health team and the primary health care health workers in order to be able to identify these outbreaks. Recently we've done um, um, a training program for the identification of uh, monkeypox across the LGA. The beauty of this is training has become easier because of we can rely on technology, we can do uh, virtual trainings as well as the physical trainings. So we're doing all this simultaneously to ensure that should there be any further outbreaks will be one of the first to actually identify that.